Well, as you can tell, uh, we're no longer at uh, Vedanta. It was always my intent to uh, do this intro piece, you know, as we were staying at Acapulco Vedanta. But, uh, you know, we were there for a couple of days, three days, and uh, we decided uh, that uh, we need to get back to the United States. So it was about uh, two and a half weeks ago that we're actually there. And, uh, you know, when I asked uh, the group if anybody had been to Acapulco Vedanta and uh, didn't get much uh, information or feedback, so I decided to shoot a little video, uh, show people what it was like. Uh, you know, so I did shoot a little video, uh, but uh, I didn't shoot as much as I wanted to, but I think it was enough to give you a little idea of, uh, of what it's like there. Um, you know, so, um, you know, I'll, I'll cut to that, but a, but a little bit about our story. Uh, we were visited there two and a half weeks ago. And uh, you know, was, things are pretty. Things are definitely calm in Mexico. No cases in the state. Uh, you know that uh, that Acapulco was in. It wasn't so bad in the United States. You're talking about the coronavirus. I'm talking okay. about the coronavirus. Because yeah. you could be talking about crime too uh, in yeah, Acapulco. Exactly. 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 <laughs> and uh, you know, but uh, we got there on a Saturday. We flew out of uh, Mexico City, you know, where we were staying for several months, and uh, things. Hour, were, 15 minute flight. Uh, yeah. Nice. And uh, we, we were, uh, you know, Sunday, spent the day on the beach. Monday, and the news started getting worse and worse in the United States. And, uh, you know, they started talking about closing the border. And we had driven to Mexico. And we started getting a little more worried. Tuesday, we decided that uh, we need to cut our vacation short, go back to, fly back to Mexico City, and uh, head back to the United States. Hence, you know, we're now in isolation, quarantine here in, in the U.S., actually in Pennsylvania. And um, I'm going to um, edit the, the video that we did take of, of Acapulco Vedanta so you get a little taste of what it's like. You know, so you can start dreaming of that when everyone can travel again. Exactly, because it's really nice. It's uh, super nice, yeah. super nice. We love the beach there, and uh, yeah, we'll definitely go back again because we only got uh, three days there before exactly. we left. And we're, we're glad we left when we did. In fact, maybe we left a day too late. Yeah. But uh, anyhow, hope you enjoy the video, and uh, hasta la vista. Hasta luego. Here's the entryway that you agree to that when you, uh, when you drive up. And a uh, picture from the other side of the entryway. Again, this is uh, pretty impressive. So our room is on uh, the 15th floor here at the Mayan Palace. This is the Mayan Palace uh, Playa. And uh, as you see here, looks like they're putting up a uh, brand new, I don't know who knows what it is. We didn't go for the update uh, because they didn't uh, offer me enough. Uh, but uh, it's by you know, Grand Bliss or uh, you know, one of those other super luxury things. Um, but um, there's the ocean, we have a great, great uh, sort of lockout one bedroom here. This is at the Mayan Palace, Mayan Palace Playa. Because there's two Mayan Palaces here. So Mayan Palace Playa, and then there's the Mayan Palace uh, Golf. And that's right over here. The Mayan Palace Golf actually has in the, the water park and the uh, lazy river uh, for the Mayan Palace side. And now, as you can see, you know it's a uh, it's across across the little road. Here's the uh, the end of the golf course, and the golf course extends, you know, up uh, up around this way. Sorry, that's into the sun. And uh, to get over there, there is a little shuttle that goes from the uh, goes to the uh, the Grand Mayan. And I'll show you a picture of the Grand Mayan from uh, from another location here, but. Um, and you now we're super happy with our room. In fact, they, uh, they offered us, tried to entice us to move to an ocean view room um, you know, for our, our update. That wasn't enough to get me to do it. You know, because Principally because we're at the end, here on the 15th floor, the, the highest floor. Now we still do have an ocean view, somewhat. So uh, not, not, enough, not enough to entice me to move. So this is from the 15th floor of the Mayan Palace Playa. And uh, you're looking at the Grand Mayan here, Grand Mayan Pool, the Grand Mayan Lazy River, and uh, the beach. And now we're going down to breakfast. This is uh, one of the Mayan Palace Playa pools. Here's the new building that they're putting up. Show 
on the swim up bar. And uh, here is the Mayan Palace Playa. And of course, the all important swim up bar. And this is the second uh, Mayan Palace Playa pool, closer to the beach. And again, the Mayan Palace pool and the Mayan Palace Playa. sort of the, the third Mayan palace pool. So the beach there in the distance. I'll show you the beach in a little bit. I think the beach is uh, great here. Right, here's where you want to uh, avoid. That's a sail center. But uh, this is all right, this is the pool here at the Grand Mayan. Pretty nice. Looking out over the beach. And the Grand Mayan here at Acapulco. Here's the beach at the Grand Mayan. And uh, see it's a pretty good sized beach because the tide's out. These white markers sort of uh, delineate what is Vedanta's property and what is uh, the public beach property. But they have uh, you know some ponies here you can ride, they have quads. Uh, guys uh, renting boogie boards, you can get their massages down here on the beach for a lot cheaper than you can get in uh, in Vedanta. But uh, you know, I, I personally think this is a, a really nice beach and uh, you know probably to me rivals the Nuevo Viarca beach. Yeah, this is the Mercado, the Boutique, uh, the, um, uh, has the frozen yogurt in here. Yeah, and actually, you see the, the balcony there with the seats? Yep. It's a really nice place to sit and have your breakfast if you buy it in there at uh, the Paris Creperie. <coughs> Excuse me. At the Paris Creperie. And here we're looking down on the Mayan Palace Beach. Again, I think this is uh, just a uh, just a great beach. Uh, and rivals, rivals uh, in the way where we are today. I'm personally not a fan of the, uh, the Riviera Maya beach, but this one's, uh, this one's really nice.